we're able to have folks take in the same amount of oxygen as they would in 90 minutes in a hyperbaric chamber in just 15 minutes. EWOT is a very close cousin of hyperbaric oxygen. The easiest way to think about it is an analogy with hyperbaric. In hyperbaric oxygen, we're laying in a tube and they're pressurizing that tube and also adding near pure oxygen. And so that pressure forces more oxygen through our lung membrane and into our blood where it's able to circulate into our body. In EWOT, what we're doing, instead of having the oxygen pushed with pressure, we're using cardiovascular exercise to pull it through. What happens when we all exercise is our body immediately recognizes that we're about to go into an oxygen starvation mode. It says, hey, I don't have enough oxygen to produce the energy to continue this cardiovascular exercise. So we have all these compensatory changes that naturally happen. You start breathing more deeply and more quickly. The membrane of your lung actually thins out to allow more oxygen to pass through. And then of course you have what's called vasodilation, which is your blood vessels get larger to carry more blood. And so all of these changes of our body these physiological changes that allow more oxygen to get through, we effectively hijack them by breathing pure oxygen at the same time. We're able to have folks take in the same amount of oxygen as they would in 90 minutes in a hyperbaric chamber in just 15 minutes.